As I began working with learning innovation in the graduate school over the summer as a consultant, I told faculty about best practices in digital pedagogy, helping them with Sakai and Zoom. I've also presented in the online TA workshop series, and along with another fellow, Dayton Kinney, I organized the winter and summer graduate academies to help graduate students lead uh, as instructors of record in their own digital classes. And my experience over the past year has shown me just how important it is to integrate technology into university classes. This means that private tech companies will continue to play a part in digital education, making it necessary for us to constantly train and retrain as we become proficient with the best digital tools. One drawback often cited for online lessons is the inability to teach asynchronously. So for the presentation that I'll give, it will be about VoiceThread, which is a platform where students can develop critical thinking and communication in synchronous and asynchronous formats. VoiceThread, and there you see it in action there, uh, it facilitates peer-to-peer -peer collaboration in language classes. Instructors put students in pairs, and then they can write and record a dialogue on VoiceThread. Asynchronous viewing of content enables the instructor to listen in at any time and then provide feedback. And students can only see and hear the comments from their professor maintaining privacy. And what you're seeing on that slide is a web recording of me uh, that I then, as, a, as if I were the instructor. Shift work in uh, schools such as nursing means that asynchronous classroom is much more appealing for training. VoiceThread is good for icebreaker activities because it's easy to record the voices of individual classmates and hearing the actual voices of peers builds community. And instructors can pause videos or have visuals on the screen to have extended discussions in their classes. And students can easily add content. In one example, the course of slides increased from 20 to 40 in one week. So that is just student-generated content. So in some, VoiceThread is dynamic enough that instructors can use it for, even for flipped classrooms. And the black background, as you can see, there makes uh, visuals um, very easy to see. So thank you very much for listening. We're going to transition to a short video that I have prepared showing a little bit more about VoiceThread in action. Language instructors can place students in pairs and then have them record their dialogue with one another, once again, in an asynchronous format. The instructor can provide feedback in written or verbal form. Clan meets Kokoa Kema Clawel Titekiti Pan Mila. You have a great voice and you're very good at enunciation. All right, well, it is always a pleasure uh, to watch yourself. So I hope everyone uh, felt my pain somewhat. Uh, thank you very much for watching that video and thank you to everyone uh, for letting me be a bass fellow, much appreciated.